Hey, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tiara's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful, my handsome Tauruses out there. How you doing? How you doing? Keep in mind that this is a gentle reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please take the press that does and what doesn't leave it all out. Also, this could be the past, the present, or the future. And to be aware of any scammers in the comments that you're pretending to be me. And so by my background, y'all, I am redecorating. Okay, redecorating. Y'all see the finished product soon. Okay, I still got to bring on the pieces to come. But yeah. So Taurus, here's the thing, you guys. There's a situation that you could be in, okay, um, with a, I don't know, this could be a partner, what have you. Or say, for example, some of you could even have a roommate. Put it where it fits, okay? But for some, or this could simply just be you. But some of y'all could have someone coming to your door, knocking on your door, giving you some type of official papers, okay? Whether this be the post office man or woman or whatever, or maybe a government official, maybe a police officer or something like that, okay? That's going to show up to your door and hand you some type of papers, okay? Some of you, yeah, because somebody was being irresponsible when it comes to something, all right? Maybe they didn't pay their half of the bill or whatever it may be, okay? Um... But yeah, but as soon as you get this letter, it's going to be some type of regret with the Five of Cups and the Four of Wands. Somebody's going to be questioning their stability, okay? Well, um, they're going to be, you know, trying to figure out where they're going to, where they're really going to go, where they're going to be, what have you. Or if they're going to pay, have them, you know, enough money to pay for whatever this is, okay? Yeah, some of you may have to get a lawyer or others of you. It's like you're going to get clarity of a certain situation, okay? You're about to get some type of clarity. Okay, and why this happened? Yeah, we got sweetheart. Yeah, you, on the other hand, didn't know what the hell was going on. Okay, yeah, you didn't know what the fuck was going on in this situation for some of y'all. Yeah, I'm also getting whoever the masculine energy is. He could have been definitely trying to talk to somebody, an outside source, okay, or even try to get a loan or something like that to pay for this bill, okay? Maybe somebody could have put something in your name, okay? And it's like you're gonna find that out, you're gonna find something out, okay? Is what I'm getting. Yeah, somebody here was definitely hoping that this situation could grow, could build, okay? Um, but it's like the communication between this mask and this feminine energy, like something is going on, okay? This person is just like spaced out or what have you and distracted, okay? You guys just can't get on the same page for nothing, all right? You're doing what you need to do. But this person here seems to, they're they're slacking is what I'm getting. Okay, we got here old woman and doctor. Maybe somebody got the news that an older woman in their family could be sick or something like that. Okay, what's the old woman doctor? We got here haughtiness. Ooh, this is okay. Uh, this is some. This is a, a superior. Okay, this could even be somebody's mother or something like that. Then we got here wife. What is this spirit? Yeah. Somebody's deep in their thought. Oh, hell no. Is this you or is this them? Who got this? I believe Scorpio got this, okay? Some of y'all... Somebody's in their head because maybe they're in a live situation or something like that. But they're in their head about another situation outside of their household. Maybe somebody had to take somebody to the hospital. Okay, maybe they, somebody could be finding out somebody pregnant. Or this could just be an older feminine energy in somebody's family. And um, they could be, they have to go to the doctor. They could be, have to have bed rest or they could have to be looked after. Okay, so this person could even be bringing in this person to the home. I don't know if there's going to be problems or something like that. I don't know what the hell I'm channeling. But we got here foe. But then we got here faithfulness. Surprise. So let's see. What is this? Yeah, because we also have somebody was waiting on something. And as they was waiting, it was like they were sad. They was in sorrow. They was, you know, down, a little bit depressed here. Waiting on someone maybe to change. Because we do have here the three of cups. Okay, the nine of pentacles and the seven of swords. Somebody could have definitely been breadcrumbing somebody. Okay. While they was out partying, you know, mingling with other third parties, okay, being sneaky with the Seven of Swords. This person was out here pleasure seeking. I know this ain't you, Taurus, baby, because I know you ain't going for that shit. Mm mm. Okay, I know you ain't going for that. Hell no. Nah. All right, but when you love somebody, you love somebody. You feel what I'm saying? But if you ain't got the proof or nothing like that, it's like you don't want to make no rational decisions on the situation. But at the same time, if all somebody can do is go out here and, and party and play with themselves, uh uh. 
okay? Because we also have your sorrow and lover, all right? Somebody is having, like, somebody's really down and out about a lover, straight up, about a marriage, hair font, that's you, Taurus, okay? Yeah, we got the Ten of Wands. Somebody's also tired of the burdens, okay? Taking on more of the weight in the situation. There's no teamwork. This is what I'm getting within this household or something. Mm. Somebody even could be telling somebody, this is for 1% of y'all. Somebody could be telling somebody that, you know, whoever they're living with, hey, I'm about to go over here. I don't want to be here anymore. Okay, I want to go to this other person or something like that. All right. Yeah, because we got cheerfulness, child, and constancy. I don't know what I don't know if somebody keep making babies or you know somebody found out that somebody was pregnant or something like that. What is cheerfulness, child, and constancy? Despair. Ooh. Somebody's in despair about a child, maybe. Okay. Hmm. What is this spirit? King of Cups. Okay, counts by Scorpio lover. What else? What about this King of Cups? The High Priestess. Okay, this could be a, a, a Pisces. Ace of Cups, King of Wands. Ooh, wee. Oh my goodness. So. Somebody could have definitely got... What's the High Priestess? Oh, they got a... Ooh, they got a Queen of Cups. Okay, Two of Cups. Yeah, Nine of Wands. Okay, Queen of Wands. Yeah, somebody's trying to figure out which way to go or something like that. What's the King of Cups and the High Priestess? Okay, Eight of Swords. Somebody could feel like they're trapped. Okay, or somebody trapped them or something. Okay. Yeah, now they're wanting to walk away. Wow. Somebody could have felt like a feminine energy trapped their ass. Okay, look, and she got the baby. <laughs> Pregnant with the baby. Hell no. Okay, yeah, seven of cups. Somebody had uh, some type of options. They're walking away from an option here. But especially if this person got somebody pregnant, they ain't about to, mm -mm, they're going to get this person. Hell, the full car, two of wands. Somebody's taking a risk somewhere else with the two of wands. Somebody's planning. Okay, star card, previous energy. Somebody wants to, Leah. Somebody's trying to heal here. All right, we got justice. Okay, Libra energy. Yeah, because this is just like a an attack or something like that. This is a betrayal. This is about to be brought to the light. Okay, there could even been a feminine energy that cheated on a masculine and ended up pregnant. Okay, or it's like for some of y'all, say, for example, there's a couple out here that knowing they can't even, you know, take care of their own household and they keep having babies and it's like people aren't going to be looking at these people like a fool okay it's what i'm getting that's not for everybody okay but yeah we got the five of swords there's some type of gossip okay surrounding you with the queen of uh uh coins damn i can't talk somebody don't want me to get this out we got the nine of swords so somebody could be definitely worried okay having anxiety three of swords energy okay so like somebody here definitely is betraying their trust is what i'm getting Okay, yeah, Ten of Pentacles. Let's see, what is this? Yeah, we got the Ace of Wands and the Four of Pentacles. Somebody here is definitely holding back sexually, okay, due to some type of magic, okay, with the magician. Lovers, oh, yeah. The fuck is this? What is going on? We got the uh, Four of Swords. Somebody's trying to affect somebody in the dream state as well. Somebody could be telepathically communicating with you for some of y'all. Yeah, death. Okay, Scorpio energy. Devil energy. Oh, my gosh. The Hermit Virgo energy. Ooh, we. So, for some of y'all, I'm seeing somebody here has definitely transformed this could be gossip. People are talking about, how, yeah, judgment. Ooh, somebody going through a judgment. They're going through the dark night of the soul is what I'm hearing here, Taurus. Okay? Something is about to come out. It's straight. It definitely is. Okay? Somebody could have had multiple partners or they had a choice between a king of wands and a king of cups or something like that. Okay? And this person doesn't know who the father is or something. 
Oh, what the hell? What is what's what's the uh five of swords? Yeah, five of wands. Oh my gosh, jealousy. This is about to be exposed. Okay, what's what's hidden is about to be exposed straight up. Damn. Yeah, we got the hermit. Okay, Virgo energy page of swords. There could be a Virgo watching you. Okay, stalking you, jealous and gossiping. Whoever this feminine energy is, okay, yeah, justice, Libra energy. You're going to get justice for this shit, okay? Somebody here wanted to definitely target you, okay, and pick at you and poke at your ass, okay? Whoever this person is, all right? Yeah. Mm. This is crazy. Yeah, here got the Queen of Cups, World Card. Something is coming to a close, okay? Maybe with a water sign feminine energy, something is coming to an end, all right? Yeah. What about this Queen of Cups? Yeah, we got the Nine of Cups. For some of y'all, you are this Queen of Cups. Okay, you can definitely be feeling more vibrant, feeling free. Okay, with the Nine of freaking Cups. <laughs> the Wheel of Fortune, yeah. Definitely. All right, Six of Wands. Wow, you're getting some type of success in your life. You're also getting a beautiful offer here. Okay, just always keep your guard up. Continue to protect your heart. Okay, continue to heal for some of y'all. Damn, we got the Eight of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles. So for some of y'all, definitely. All right, I see that some of you could definitely be moving on. Okay, from this, whoever this person is, is what I'm getting. Okay, they might got something going on. Okay, somebody could have got somebody else pregnant or something of that nature, y'all. Okay, or some of you, this is not a third party. It's like you went to the doctor, you could have found out that you were pregnant, you're having another child. People may judge you guys um, due to that. That's for some of y'all. All right, or, but who gives a fuck? I mean, at the end of the day, you know, live your life, do what you do. If you can afford the babies, you can afford the babies. Okay. But yeah, this is this is the odd damn reading today. I'm gonna tell you that. What else, spirit? It says you can learn a lot of good lessons from a few fucked up people. Exactly. All right, take a moment to think about a major lesson in your life. Did your heart get broken? Did a friend betray you? Did the heartbreak teach you not to settle? Are you resilient and self-reliant now? Because you had to be? Think of the fucked up person that taught you that lesson, period. Okay, send them a little cosmic thank you, gratitude to, you know, for the lesson that you learned from them. Okay? It doesn't excuse what, you know, excuse what they did, of course not. All right, but it does help you avoid going back in the end for that same lesson with a new fucked up person, though. Mm. Mm. Yeah, it's just think twice before you give a fuck, period. Ask yourself this. What if that thing that's bothering, worrying, haunting you didn't matter? Okay, if it didn't matter, would you be happier, kinder, more productive? If it didn't matter, would you sleep better? Would you let yourself enjoy an ice cream cone or whatever else your heart desires? Okay, if so, then don't give a fuck. If not, giving a fuck means going against one of, you know, one of your core values, then go ahead, give that fuck. You're not supposed to never give a fuck. The point is to give him, you know, give him where it matters, okay? To balance your fucks, okay? If your fucks was money, would you drop that much money here? Yeah, not. So take care. Spend your fucks wisely, period, okay? All right, now, Taurus. Lord, have mercy. This was a lot. Put your energy where it fits, okay? But I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.